In this video, we're going to have a look at making this uh, WhatsApp icon that you see here in the bottom right hand corner. And when you click on it, it's going to open up the WhatsApp. So if I translate that to English, you'll see that it's chat on WhatsApp. We open in WhatsApp, and when it opens in WhatsApp, it also pre populates the text. And the text message in this case just says, Tell me more. So we're going to have a look and see how to create that. So I'm going to close that down going to shut that down and of course I'm using oxygen so I'm going to head over into oxygen and I'm going to delete that content element save that and then what I'm going to do is recreate so here I've logged into my oxygen template I'm on the main template for the header footer and what I'm going to do now is add that element to the footer so in the footer the first thing I'm going to do then is add a div right so I've added the div and I'm going to head over to advanced Going to head over to layout and I'm going to set the layout to fixed and we'll make that 30 from the right and 30 from the bottom. Next thing I do, I'm going to add an icon and the icon there will be for WhatsApp. Right, that's the icon added. And now I'd like to make that a solid icon with a bit of white space and it's a little bit too much white space, so let's. Pop that uh, to about five, and that's looking good. And then maybe you want to change that icon color to the green, which is more in keeping with WhatsApp. So uh, we can get the exact color of the internet, uh, but for now we'll just go with that. So there we have the WhatsApp icon. I'm going to save that. And the next thing that we need to do then is uh, let's create um, the link for that. Before I do that, I'm just going to rename that WhatsApp, so I know that what that is. Right, now what, let's go and get that URL. So to get the URL, the easiest way is to go to um, WhatsApp uh, URL. And you'll see here that in the FAQ for WhatsApp.com, we've got a how to use click to chat. Simply click on that. And you'll see how that there's a good explanation on how that works. And um, yeah, if you want to have a look at that, um, if you want to get the color, I have this Colorzilla color picker. I'm just going to move down, grab that color. So now I can go to my icon color and replace that. And now we've got the right WhatsApp green. And then to get the URL, here's an example of the URL. And what we're going to do then is just copy that example. Going to head back to Oxygen, and now I'm going to add in that URL. So I'm going to add the URL then to the div, and we'll just paste that in and say open link in new tab. And then we just need to put in our number. So uh, it's your country code and then the number. And then very importantly, don't delete the question mark. And then everything after the equal, I am going to remove and tell me more. Make that the message. Um, a bit more courteous maybe. Right, and we're going to add the link. And I also want that to open in a new target window so we make sure it's target is underscore blank going to save going to head back to the website going to refresh so there's our new icon without the drop shadow and click on that let's see english open in whatsapp the um, application then opens in whatsapp and also then pre-populates the message hello tell me more so very easy now for somebody to get hold of you simply by clicking on that link. And the only thing left to do maybe is to add a drop shadow to that icon. So let's head over to effects and then look at box shadow. And let's just uh, maybe a zero. Let that drop down a bit and a bit of shadow blur something like that and scroll up and just change that from inset into the outside and you'll see now that it's a square 
shadow because we applied that to the div. So to fix that, then we're just going to go to advanced and we'll just go to borders, make that 50 and we're done. Save. And now when we refresh on the page, we now have the little WhatsApp icon button. So that's literally how easy it is to add the WhatsApp contact button to your website. Um, if you're not happy with um, that particular round area and you maybe you want to do something like uh, chat on WhatsApp, maybe you want to follow this guideline, then very easy. We can head on over here um, to our link wrapper, which was the div, and we're just going to set um, the horizontal method for text and then we can go here to our text icon right and the text to use then is chat on whatsapp so chat on whatsapp and of course then we want to just change a couple of things here first of all we're going to change the radius so let's go to the borders and i'm just going to drop that right down so we just have a little bit of a turn on it then what we're also going to do now is um, size and spacing we're just going to add a little bit of padding all around and maybe not so much at the top and the bottom and then what i'm going to do is move the background color to green so let me just get that green here and, and we'll go to the background color We'll make that the green and then of course we want to change things around here so i'm going to head over to the icon now and uh, we're going to change that uh, to white so now we have the whatsapp icon take off outline and then we just have the white icon and then we're going to change that text color there to white and of course um, from the typography side, we can just make that a little bit bigger. And now we're getting very close to what was there. And of course, we just need to add some spacing in here. So back to um, size and spacing. And right, um, let's make that. 10 and then just add a little bit more spacing here so maybe eight eight so there we have chat on whatsapp it's not exactly the right font i'm not sure what font they use um but um no that's not good We'll just keep it with our font there, save, refresh, and now you'll see that you have the chat on WhatsApp, of course, insert, and if you want to check that on mobile, then uh, you'll see that on mobile that doesn't work too good. Um, so then on mobile with oxygen, it's really easy. We can change that font size down to 18. We can change the icon size down to, um, let's make that 30. Save that. And now when we refresh, you'll see that we have uh, a much better size chat on WhatsApp. Another way of doing it then, if you want to go with the longer button, is to change it completely. and what we'll do then is I'm going to go to and I'm going to make the width 100%. I'm also going to make sure there's no margins here. And then I'm going to go to layout and I'm going to go down here to fixed and we're going to make that naught, naught, naught. And then of course we're going to change that border radius to zero. And then maybe what I'm going to do. Make that a bit bigger. So now what happens is that when our page loads, you'll see that we have chat on WhatsApp all the way across the bottom, which is a little bit better and doesn't block off any content. And of course, if somebody does click on that, um, 
it will open up WhatsApp as it should. So there you have it. Just um, you know, different ways that you can apply the chat on WhatsApp button. Very easy to install. Uh, very easy to set up. So yeah, I just want to say thanks for watching, and I hope you enjoyed the video.